the top stories on ABC News 24, Al-Qaeda has confirmed the death of its mastermind Osama bin Laden. The terrorist group posted the statement on jihadist websites. Al-Qaeda has also vowed to avenge the death of its leader and has warned celebrations in the West will soon be replaced by sorrow and blood. U.S. President Barack Obama has met members of the Special Forces team that caught and killed Osama bin Laden. The talks were held in private at a military base in Kentucky. President Obama thanked the team for a job well done. There are reports at least 30 people have been killed during anti-government protests in Syria. Thousands of Syrians have taken part in a day of defiance against the regime of President Bashar al-Assad. Deaths have been reported in the cities of Homs and Hama, bringing the toll to at least 500 since the protests began. And a coroner in Britain says London is woefully underprepared for a terrorist attack at the 2012 Olympic Games. Announcing the results of an inquiry into the 2005 London bombings, the judge concluded that the attacks could not have been prevented, but conceded emergency services could have been better equipped. And those are the latest headlines from ABC News.